Hello and mabuhay and welcome to Ibitoy Universe And for tonight's episode, we'll be featuring my finished LEGO Custom Level 40 Stegos from Jurassic World The Game And here's our before and after Before, after, before, after, before, after, awesome Guys, this is Uncle Mike And this is me, of course my minifigure this is my very own minifigure but I think I shouldn't be here because I have to welcome our Dino Master Challenge uh, winner for 2023 and I'm going to introduce to you to him come on ta we still have our Champion Cretaceous Bricks for 2022 and 2023 Dynamaster Championship. Uh, I think Cretaceous, you need to have a change of clothes. Okay, so see you in a bit. In one, two, three. Ta-da! And this is the new Cretaceous Bricks. So guys, let's congratulate again Cretaceous because. He is our two-time defending champion for our Dynamaster Challenge. So, if you want to be like Cretaceous Bricks, then join our Dynamaster Challenge. Congratulations, Cretaceous Bricks. That's me, Extinct Bricks. Yes, congratulations. So, take it away, Extinct uh, Cretaceous Bricks. So... This is Cretaceous. So again, if you want to be our new uh, champion, then beat Cretaceous for our 2024 Dynamaster Challenge. Usually every Tuesday, uh, 7:30 p.m. Manila time. Okay, and this is our um, Stego Rose based from this particular photo from Jurassic World the game. Of course, um. If you can see the resemblance, of course, there is a resemblance in it. This is the smallest yet that I've uh, customized here on this channel. And, you know, to be honest, I thought it would be easy for me. I could finish it in one hour, but it's not. It's much harder than the big uh, base figure, you know, because of the articulations and the uh, designs. They're so difficult to uh, execute and that's why it took me almost one day to finish this one and look I have a uh, change of course uh, if you haven't watched the uh, the making or the uh, tutorial video this one is made up of two uh, human uh, minifigure I just combine it I just um, put them together and then the rest like this one this is also uh, I think what's this uh, this is a sculpted one but this is the head and also the head of a human Lego and this is the arms these are the arms I just uh, modify it I mean the hands I just turned this into uh, feet of uh, Stego Rose using, I think this is a uh, goat, this is a goat uh, hooves or feet. Anyways, as for its size, I know this is a lot lot bigger compared to this one because this is the real Stegosaurus in real life. This one is far, far bigger compared to this one. Anyways, it's okay. Once or if there's uh, an available uh, smaller uh, figure in the future, why not? But for now, this is an okay size for this particular uh, customs. Okay? So, I think we need to introduce now to our guest starting off with the Listosaurus from the Jurassic World Dominion movie 
this was uh, of course customized by Extinct Bricks. I think this is the second version of Lister Source, right? Yes. Yes, so this is the... That is the 3D printed version from Chavero Bricks. Ah, okay. This is a 3D version of the uh, base figure from Chavero Bricks. This one is a lot, lot uh, lower. I mean, look, oh, it has a shorter legs and the limbs, I mean, compared to this one. So, presenting Listrosaurus. Thank you, Listro. Up next, we have uh, one of the oldest uh, customs by Extinct Breaks, the mini uh, figure. This is Microceratus. Microceratus, right? Oh, sorry. This is Protoceratops. And, um... I think this is a seven-year-old or eight-year-old, ten or eight-year-old custom uh, made by Extinct Bricks. Of course, he uses also the same figure. This one is um, the hands of a human uh, Lego. Look at the evolution of Extinct Bricks um, uh, customs. It's so. Um, yeah, that's the correct term. It's remarkable and it's very, very, I uh, know, and it's very, very uh, different from what he's doing right now. This one, I think, uh, extinct race, you need to uh, revise this one. I know you can do this a lot, lot better than this, but this is one is okay, but you know. Since you have uh, evolved or you have uh, leveled up a lot, you can do it. This is again uh, my uh, Protoceratops. Up next, we have here the Microceratops. This one is a lot thinner compared to this one because I think he uses only one human body on this one, or he just uh, uh, turn it. Uh, sidewards for the body and then cut some uh, parts in it look it's so thin compared to this one but it's okay it's so cute look at the um, the amount of uh, detailing that he put on it and it's so wow amazing up next we have here the guys this is Takosaurus uh, again I think this is the second version if I'm not mistaken um, I'm the one who suggested uh, Extinct Bricks to create a Sitakosaurus for his uh, mini non dinosaur um, customs and he did this one and it's so cute if these two will fight, of course, I will go with Stegoros. Up next, one of the cutest, and uh, probably the cutest, Bumpy. No words for this one. This is... Oh my gosh, this is so divine. It's so cute. Look. I love also the color. It's so foggy. Foggy in Tagalog means handsome. Look, oh. So cute and it and it can roll. Oink. So cute. Yay. And then uh, up next we have uh, I think I will consider this the smallest not until uh, I made this one. The, the thinnest, the smallest uh, customs by Proceratosaurus. Level 40 based on this particular photo. Just check it out. Look at the resemblance. I love it. Although it doesn't have uh, uh, what do you call that um, articulation, but the um, what do you call the um, impression is there, and that's all right with me. So cute. Look all uh, the details. And of course, since this is a Stegoros, let's put in, or let's welcome in, 
Charan, guys, I'm so sorry. Uh, actually, the extinct bricks and uh, uh, plan to uh, revise this one. This is the Stegoros from Extinct Bricks. This is the original photo of this one. He decided to uh, revise it, but then he didn't uh, wasn't able to finish it on time. For this is only a uh, base uh, base color. This is uh, the uh, primer Stegoro. So I think. It has a lot of changes already if you could see in the picture over here from the original one but it's okay this one has a more sloping uh, back humpy humpy back sorry and that's it so I'm so sorry extinct bricks I will I uh, I preempted your <laughs> your stagger rules but guys so see you I'm the launching of this uh, Stegros video very very soon and that is all for now for our uh, visitors guys the gang is complete so again uh, thank you thank you so much for those who participated uh, for 2023 uh, Dynamasters so 2024 is still ongoing so if you can beat uh Cretaceous, why not? But uh let's see who will be our next champion. Would it be uh still uh Cretaceous or we have a new king? Well if you want it then be the fastest to guess. So and also guys uh please don't forget to leave a comment or suggestions for our future uh uh, customs and please share it on your wall and don't be shy to subscribe if you haven't subscribers yet on this channel please we're only i think we're less than 30 or 20 subscribers away from mission 5000 so let's do this guys and now we do some quick recap on our uh friends right over here we have Sitakosaurus, our baby bumpy the microceratus level 40 proceratosaurus listrosaurus uh the unfinished um uh, stegoros from extinct bricks and of course this is the uh proceratosaurus and of course the start of tonight's uh, video we have Level 40 Stagros. Yay! And that's all for now for our Stagros Level 40 video. Bye bye! And please don't forget to subscribe on our other channel, Extinct Mix, our main dinosaur channel, Ibito Universe. Of course, this is our Ibito Universe channel. Uh, Tito Mike's Kitchen, our food and cooking channel, and the Adventures of Warren and Asher, our pet dog channel. So, see you again next time, guys. Thank you. Bye.